all things Halloween. <laughs> This is Haunt Former, and everyone, welcome back to another R.I.P. Review, the show where I review various Halloween products, movies, food, you name it, and today I am back again with the hanging Michael Myers prop from Amazon.com. Now this is a really cool Michael Myers product. Uh, actually, I had people on my social media uh, vote to have this prop reviewed, so make sure to go on my social media to actually get the exclusive looks at my props that I purchase. Uh, but this is a Michael Myers prop I picked up from Amazon, as I just mentioned. Uh, he does have a tag on his head that does say Halloween. He is a 15-inch tall Michael Myers uh, product, and he does hang because, of course, he's got this little hanging cord from him. Now, this is a really cool prop. I'll share with you the pros and cons of him. Uh, one pro is that he's made out of a latex, so he is a, a pretty good quality for the head, the hands, and his little knife, as you can see. It's a little flimsy, but that's okay. Uh, his hair is real hair, which is also pretty nice. The one issue with it is it sheds, and if you can't tell, it is all over his body. Speaking of his body, it's actually made of a pretty good material. Uh, it might be a little cheap, but it actually is a lot better than most of the material you get with Halloween props because it tends to be see-through, and this product, I'm shining a light at it right now, and it is not see-through. Also, something to mention, his arms are pretty poseable, so you can get him in some cool positions. You can maybe get him in a stabbing position. Uh, also, one other thing to note is the shirt tends to come off the arms a bit, so if you have uh, some Velcro or some tape, you can possibly get it to stay on there a little bit better. Now, Michael here does uh, hang. I would say stand, but he doesn't really stand. He hangs about 15 inches. So he's a pretty good height for a Michael Myers product. And he's got pretty good detail. As you can tell, the hands are sculpted pretty good. And the face definitely has a good resemblance to that William Shatner mask. Of course, you got the eyebrows in there with the eyes. Uh, he's looking pretty creepy. Now, the best part of this guy is the price. Now, this Michael Myers, I paid, I think, around seven-ish dollars for. Now, of course, shipping's going to add several dollars onto that, but seven dollars for this guy. Seven dollars. That's right. You're not paying, you know, twenty, thirty dollars for this Michael Myers. And this is a Halloween-licensed official product, so that is really cool. And, um, he is just a really nice prop that will be great for this year's Haunted House and really for any Halloween display, especially if you're a fan of Michael Myers and the Halloween films. So, if you do not have this guy, check in the description. I'll try to post a link to the Amazon page where you can get your very own Michael Myers and let me know if you pick him up in the comments below. And uh, overall, this guy is really, really cool. I recommend him, and I think I'm going to give him a 3.5 skull rating. Uh, the reasoning is because he's not the best quality, but for the price, you really can't go wrong. I mean, the hair, yeah, it sheds, and yeah, the wiring isn't the best, but hey, it's $7. So, definitely worth the money for this Michael Myers prop. He is really cool, and I definitely recommend him for any Halloween display, especially if it is a Halloween, huh? You get it? The movie? Never mind. Halloween display. So thank you again for watching this R.I.P. review, and make sure to subscribe to Hauntformer to see more Halloween videos throughout the entire year. And remember, for all things Halloween, this is Hauntformer.